ladies and gentlemen, this is the Oak Knoll Troll. I bring to you another Star Wars Galaxy tutorial. Today's focus is on the AFK Melee Combat Macro. This is the agenda for the Melee Combat Macro, and what I'll be doing in this video is breaking down what makes up the Combat Macro. There's very specific things when it comes to targeting, selecting the right special attack, adding delays, and making sure that the macro loops. After I've thoroughly explained exactly what the macro does, what we're going to do is take a character and run the macro. First thing you want to do is do Control A, and that's going to bring up your command browser. In the bottom left hand corner, click on New Macro. Up at the top, you're going to want to type in AFK Melee Combat Macro. Take note of the uppercase and lowercase of the macro name, select an icon, and then click down on the macro text. The first command that we're going to want to do is stand. The reason you do this is because you want to have your character stand. Some mobs will knock you down or posture change down, and in a posture down state or any other state other than standing, you're not going to be able to execute any type of attack command. So after that, we're going to put in a small pause, a 0.5 half a second pause. You're going to want to do this because your character sometimes is executing a command or there's a server lag, so put in like a half a second. Next thing you want to do is you're going to target yourself. We're going to abbreviate this by just putting in tar self. A lot of commands in Star Wars Galaxies are like this. You may get used to them. It may, may be faster to type BO instead of board to board a shuttle. We're doing the same thing here. Put in a small pause, and then we want to do a UI action cycle target outward. And the reason we're doing this is because we want to select the next mob away from us that we can attack. Now we're going to put in another half a second pause. So next thing we got to do is select what type of attack we're going to do. So say I want to be a TK, so I'm going to go to Brawler, and then I'm going to go to Novice Brawler, since say that's the first box I have. I'm going to scroll down, I'll let my mouse hover, you'll see it says Unarmed Lunge 1. So that's going to be my first attack as a Novice Brawler. So we're going to do Unarmed Lunge 1. Now I'm going to copy and paste it three times because you may or may not be able to kill the character or the mob that you're attacking with just one hit. And then we're going to put a three second pause for it to execute all those unarmed lunges. So next thing we're going to do is macro, recall our macro with a slash M and then put in what we named it up at the top. We're going to click OK, drag it over to our hot bar after we review that it is what we put in there. We're gonna hit Control A again, close our command browser, and then we're gonna go mount up and try to find ourselves a mob. So I know that this is very fast. You may need to slow it down, watch it once or twice to get it done for yourself. And that's basically a very basic combat macro. So we found this mob, I'll put myself in the center, and then I'm going to on the hot bar, I'm going to do a shift F9 because it's in the lower bar under the F9 key. And it's going to target myself and then start killing all the mobs. So I'm do this one by one. It takes about five seconds to go through the entire macro with all the half second pauses and the three second pause. So that's basically what your character is going to do for now until you get all the XP that you need in unarmed combat to be a TKM. I believe that over two weeks it took about yeah, it took about two weeks to get TKM. What we're gonna do now is fast forward. So we have enough XP that we get another box, which means we get another attack. So we've gone from novice brawler, unarmed lunge one. Now we're at unarmed fighting one, which gives us unarmed hit one. So what we're going to do is do control A, bring up our command browser, select the macro, click edit. We're going to delete unarmed lunge and replace it with unarmed hit one. We're going to copy and paste it two times. So there's a total of three. Hit OK. Escape, escape. And then now our macro is going to be able to run unarmed hit one, which has more power. I hope that you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching.